Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all staying healthy and safe and I hope you guys are all doing really well. Today is actually the first day of our like official lockdown in our city. We've never had like official orders to stay home until today. We've been social distancing and most people in our area have been doing the same, but now that it's official, it's just kind of like, you know you can't go out, so it's just kind of like crazy. But to keep myself busy this weekend, I am going to deep clean and sanitize my entire house. So I thought I would just film on one of these it's been forever since i filmed a clean with me also with me being 22 weeks pregnant today i've actually been feeling the nesting mode if you guys don't know what nesting is basically it's when pregnant women have the like strong desire to just like get their house all ready to like get ready for baby basically so like cleaning organizing like just getting things prepped so today is saturday so i don't think i'm gonna be able to get the whole house today i mean some days i have like that much energy but just like i don't know i don't think i'm gonna be able to get everything done today so i may have to break this up between today and tomorrow to get everything finished but i do want to deep clean my kitchen i actually had my robot vacuum going but i paused it because it was kind of loud so i'm gonna let that kind of like cycle around a few times make sure the floor is really clean and then mop afterward i'm also gonna get to the bathrooms and and what else kitchen bathrooms and then floors that's like the main things that i want to do right now let's get started oh if you guys can see the disaster behind me <laughs> so i actually never let the dishes pile up that bad but amanda and i were filming a ramadan recipes video yesterday which took a lot of cooking and i just kind of let the dishes pile up because i knew i was going to be filming this today <laughs> honestly but it's never usually this bad this isn't like a normal amount of dishes for me let's go ahead and get to cleaning <laughs> I would show you guys some of the products I love using on a daily basis. This is like an all-purpose cleaning spray that I use all the time by Love Home and Planet and their cleaning sprays you guys smell so good like you have to try these. These are the best ones in the entire world. My favorite scents that they have is the tea tree one and the lavender one but all of them smell amazing honestly. And then for the floors I love using the Myers Clean Day um, concentrate and then this one is in honeysuckle but I also love the basil scent. I usually like to use more natural cleaning products and obviously since I'm pregnant I want to be super careful. Just finished the entire kitchen. I also um, wiped down the stove top. I didn't film that, but everything is wiped down and all clean. I just need to put up the dishes once they dry. I'm gonna go ahead and start my diffuser. I got a little sample kit from doTERRA on Amazon because 
their essential oils are a little bit pricey so i got like little mini sizes just to try them out they are so good i believe they're food grade so you can literally put these like in your water like if you want to put some like lemon drops in your water they're so so good so i'm gonna um do some lemon i have a little bit of the eucalyptus left over this one's a little bit less expensive brand i'm gonna put these in my sink just down the drain and it'll make it smell really good too It is the next day. Wow, I was not expecting to get so tired after just literally cleaning the kitchen, but I did like deep clean it. So I like really put some effort into that. But basically being pregnant has just made me like have a lot less energy than I'm used to. Oh, that's my Instacart order. One second. Okay, so got my groceries. So I'm just so thankful that Instacart is still available during our like mandatory stay at home orders <laughs> for our county. I was like worried that I was gonna have to still go to the grocery store. I'm such a homebody anyway, so like staying home isn't not really bothering me at all. But a lot of the things were actually like out of stock. Like I wasn't expecting our little small town for all of the people to just be hoarding, but they are. So there was absolutely no eggs at the grocery store like whatsoever, but anyways, we'll make do. <laughs> Another reason I just really couldn't film last night, honestly, is because my anxiety was just at an all-time high and I literally broke down just wanted to be honest with you guys because I didn't want to like act like it's just not affecting me whatsoever it's like really affecting me and I'm just having to like really stay away from the news I'm honestly just really worried about Omar I feel like if I wasn't pregnant and my husband did not work at the hospital I wouldn't be freaking out so much and also I'm like super sensitive anyways because I'm like pregnant it's just been affecting me a lot so i'm praying for everyone who is working in the front lines all the nurses all the doctors all the healthcare workers everyone i am praying for you all thank you guys so much for everything that you do and i'm just praying that we all stay healthy and safe and i'm trying not to think about it too much i'm trying to like keep myself busy so we are going to continue the cleaning today <laughs> basically i have plans to do all the laundry i have like couple baskets of laundry I need to fold and put up. I want to deep clean my bathroom and I actually need to clean out my skincare drawer really bad so we're gonna do that together. And then later today um, once I have my robot vacuum cycle around one more time I'm gonna go ahead and mop. Um, let me show you guys my robot vacuum. I've shared it before but I thought I'd just show it again. It is the Robo Rock S5 I believe but I will link it. It is amazing. It also mops and the mopping function is great um, just for kind Kind of like maintenance but i'm gonna do like a deep clean with the mop today it is a lifesaver i barely ever have to get the actual vacuum out thought i would share what i got from the grocery store from my instacart order so actually there have been a lot more things out of stock than i was really expecting like a lot of our meat has been out of stock a lot of like eggs a lot of like rice like i couldn't find white rice and which is i mean that's not that big of a deal like i said i think during this time we should be less picky and just like you know have a good attitude and so i did find organic brown rice which is fine but i don't know why i was like craving white rice and i just couldn't find it but it's totally fine so i have some organic russet potatoes this is something that i will just not really compromise on if i can't get organic potatoes then i just won't eat them there are a lot of pesticides used on potatoes so i always like to get organic brown rice like i said i'm gonna make chicken potatoes and a salad and then i'm also gonna make salmon asparagus and potatoes as well i'm also gonna try to make a vegan alfredo sauce that i saw on dr mona's instagram page so the recipe calls for cashews nutritional yeast garlic lemon and you just like mix it all up and it becomes this really creamy dairy-free sauce that you can put on pasta so i got my gluten-free pasta this is my favorite brand for gluten-free it's like a rice pasta and it literally tastes the same as regular pasta what we do sometimes is we will take frozen peaches and we'll put them on the stove and just like get them like really hot and gooey kind of like a peach cobbler but it's just peaches and you can add like honey to it you can add like some walnuts on top it is such a good dessert i also got some cherry tomatoes and lettuce i also got some bananas and some mandarins and i also also got some cilantro to season my chicken with even though the chicken that they got me um, was just so tiny I was expecting to get a whole chicken and they're just out of everything so beggars cannot be choosers I also just stocked up on some more of our peanut butter and honey that we were running low on so that's kind of everything 
that I got for this week. About to grab the laundry so I can start folding, but I wanted to share this um, container that I got for my laundry detergent powder. I am obsessed with it. I used to just keep the, the detergent box here and it was so un aesthetic <laughs> is that a word <laughs> but anyways i got this from amazon it's like a big cookie jar and it's so nice i just need to replace the the little scooper with a um a clear one and i ordered it from amazon it is coming but i don't know why like little things like that just make me happy <laughs> once it gets up i'm gonna like strip the sheets off the bed and clean the sheets and like clean our bedroom and everything but i'm just gonna wait till he wakes up right now i'm gonna work on the bathroom before i clean i'm gonna go ahead and like organize all of my beauty products and get get rid of stuff that i'm not using right now and the drawers in here are ridiculous so this is supposed to be my everyday beauty drawer and it is overflowing i have a bunch of stuff in here that i'm like trying out and just it's just overflowing so we're gonna get that under control and i also think i'm gonna go ahead and clean off the acrylic trays that i have I'm just storing things because it's been a little while i'm also gonna get the mats out and clean those and then we'll work on cleaning so let's go So this looks a lot better. I wiped everything down so it's all nice and clean. And I also cleared out my skincare drawers. I still have some things in here that I'm testing. I'm testing out some new skincare. It's like a clean beauty skincare from Walmart. So it's affordable and clean. The brand is called Earth to Skin and they have some really good ingredients. So I will be putting this on my Instagram soon. Top drawer is like toothbrushes, deodorant, just kind of like daily necessities. Then I have my skincare and then Omar's side is supposed to have like his shaving stuff, but I kind of took over his side with my skincare too. And then down here is basically just like all of my like pedicure stuff, like nail files, like foot buffers, um, facial razors, extra toothbrush heads. And then I have like my nail products if I ever want to do my nails. 
and then some washcloths and then my body scrubbers for the shower under the sink cabinet kind of still looks pretty good i've cleaned this out i think within the last six months and i have all my hair tools and products here tanning stuff and then travel skincare and makeup back there so it's looking good now to wipe down the mirrors the counters the sinks everything and just get everything sanitized Just sent Omar off to work. He woke up super late. I think it was almost five when he woke up. And so I actually made him some shrimp and some marinara pasta really fast before he like headed out the door. And now I am going to strip the sheets off of this bed because yeah, I'm gonna bleach everything and just make sure it's super sanitized. <laughs> Just finished mopping i tried to do time lapses but my memory card just has absolutely no more memory for <laughs> time lapses so i got what i could but i wanted to say that i know i shared this earlier but the honeysuckle scent by myers clean day smells so good my whole house smells so good now feeling very accomplished but very tired let me show you an overview of everything that's clean we have the living room straightened up and mopped and then I have the kitchen, which normally I don't like so much stuff out on the countertops, but I mean, this is a real house, so everything's clean though. Dining room. My chairs look so much better now that they're white. Bedroom is all mopped and tidied up and sheets are washing. Not gonna be able to put the clean ones on tonight, so I'm definitely just gonna be sleeping with no sheets. I cannot be the only one who can't get their sheets washed, dried, and put back on in the same day. It's so hard. And then obviously I went ahead and mopped the bathroom, so they're all finished. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Now I'm gonna go take a really good shower, <laughs> exfoliate, and just like deep clean myself. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed and let me know what you guys wanna see next. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.